In this video, I'm going to teach you how to transfer Xbox Power to Steam. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. If you have saves from Power on Xbox Game Pass on PC and you would like to transfer them to Steam, you can do this by using a specific tool. So by default, you cannot just drag and drop the files. They are not interchangeable between these platforms, so you will need to convert the files from Xbox Game Pass into files that Steam is able to read. So you need to download this tool. Look for XGP Save Extractor on Google. It is developed by z one ne and it is available on GitHub. So the Xbox Game Pass Save Extractor. This is a Python script, so you will be able to run it to get this converted. You should be able to run this even if you don't have Python installed on your computer, but if you run it and it doesn't work, then just make sure to download that as well. So you can see a list of all the games that are going to be confirmed as working, including PAL World. So click on the release at the right side of the screen and then download this exe file. You don't need to download the source code here. So just click on XGP save extractor.exe. Now I recommend that you extract this in a folder somewhere isolated from everything. Every time that you run this, a zip file will be created containing your saves converted. So when you first open the exe, this is what it looks like. Xbox Game Pass for PC Save File Extractor. It should automatically find Power World on your PC, including any other games, for example, Starfield. But the main one for this video, of course, is going to be Power World. So it is going to pick up all of the save files, including your worlds, characters, and so on, and it is going to create a zip file containing them here. So like I said before, they will be converted into this zip file. If you open the zip, you will have a folder and then user options.sav. Inside of this folder, you will have the players folder, level, local data, world option, level meta, and so on. This is essentially your world broken down, or your save rather. And if you have multiple folders, each one is going to refer to a specific world that you created. So keep that in mind. It might be annoying to distinguish between all of them if you had multiple worlds, but all of them will be converted. Now, what you have to do is create a world on Steam. So, on the Steam version of Power World, create a random world. This is a throwaway world because you will be getting the files that were converted from your Xbox Game Pass world and overriding the files in the throwaway world that you create. So, this is just going to be a throwaway world. It doesn't matter what you select because everything will be substituted. So, now, you will find your save on app data, local, pal, saved, save games, and then your Steam ID. In here, you will have all of your worlds that you created, including the throwaway. So you will have world 1, for example, 2, 3, 4, and so on. You can sort them by date modified and see which one is the most recent one. This will give you an indication of which world you just created to throw away. So now you open that folder and then you drag all of the contents from the converted world by using XGP into that row away. If it asks you if you want to overwrite these files, choose yes, and everything will be converted over. And now your Xbox Game Pass world will be placed in your Steam saves. So I hope I was able to help you. If this video helped you, please consider subscribing. As you can see, according to the channel metrics, 83% of the people watching our videos are not subscribed. By subscribing, you can help us from the channel make higher quality videos. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.